Hey, this is Crystal, and we're looking at reasons there are corrupt Word files. So, there's a lot of reasons for this. <laughs> if you share documents with people via email and they open it, they save it, and they send it back to you, those are, that's just one reason. But I'm going to cover just two of them that I see quite often. If you have a Word document, well, first of all, I'm in Word 2003. You're in Word 2010. If I constantly convert this back and forth, that can be a big reason for a Word corrupt file. Now, here I am in a Word document, and it was done in 2003. If I look at the taskbar, now I know my title says Word 2003, but you see where it says compatibility mode? I'm in 2010 Word, and compatibility mode means that I can open up any document in any Word type application from Word 97 to Word 2010. If it's not in the current version of Word that I'm working on, then it says compatibility mode. So suggestion, if you're just doing a save, so I'm just adding some text in this document, and I just do a regular save, it saves as a Word 2003 file. Well, that's pretty easy, and we do, we do that all the time. If I do a save as, so I'm just going to do a file and a save as, And instead of this save as type, I save it, I click on the drop down arrow and say Word document, it saves to my current version of Word. So now if I look in the title bar, that compatibility mode is gone, and it's just a Word 2010 file, no matter what I've called it. Very important, if you get this file and you're in 2003, don't do the save as, just consistently just do a save. Anyone will be able to open and add text to the file and do some formatting. It's some of the high-end features in Word that won't be available. If you're not using that in your Word document, then don't go back and forth and do that convert. So there you go. Just a couple of reasons why there may be a corrupt document in Microsoft Word. This is Crystal. See you soon.